Welcome to the Crochet Channel, the best place in the universe to learn crochet online. It's great you're here today because it's always a lovely day to crochet. If you like crochet or kittens or you just want to help me out, click like, subscribe and ring the bell so you don't miss out on your crochet channel videos. Yay! First of all, we are going to learn the basics of crochet stitches. So to begin, you will need to create a slip knot. You are done! And then crochet a shape. Next, let's move on to crochet a slip stitch. Next, crochet single crochet. Next, crochet half double crochet. Next, crochet double crochet. And the last one, crochet triple crochet. These are the crochet stitches you need to know. If you are ready, let's get started on the exciting crochet project. In this video, I will show you how to crochet a mesh dress with the long sleeves. For this one, if you don't want the sleeves, you can just stop for this and you need to continue. And this one, if you don't want to make a long dress, you can make the shirt instead. You can just stop here or you can stop here. You can design your own shirt. Okay, if you are ready, let's get started. Before you begin, Create a slip knot. And then crochet a foundation chain, yarn over, pull through, chain one, chain two, three. We will keep continuing this process until you have chain 128. Keep continuing. Now I have the foundation chain, chain 100. 28 and then I will join Make sure the chain is not twisted and then join to this Chain 1 and then single crochet And then crochet chain 5 1 2 3 four five and then we will skip the stitch three stitches one two three and then crochet in the fourth one single crochet one two three four five and then skip three stitches one two three and single crochet we will keep repeating this process all the way around until the end of the round one. So for this one, I already crochet chain five, single crochet all the way around. And now I will make the hole for arm hole. And then we will make the arm hole part. This one will be the neck part and this one the arm part. This one I separate to six space. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then marker. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight marker. This one the same, and this one the same. And then this one, I will join the first round. To join the first round, chain one, two, and then double crochet. There you go. This created the first round. And then the second round, chain one, single crochet, and then chain five. 
one, two, three, four, five, and then single crochet. And then keep repeating this process until the stitch marker. And then at the corner, we will crochet chain seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then single crochet like this. And next, chain five. One, two, three, four, five. And then single crochet. So we will add chain seven, only the corner that we do the stitch marker. Chain seven, and then you can see that the single crochets, this one chain seven, and you can see the single crochets together in one space. Keep repeating this process all the way around with the rest, and I will be right back at the end of the round. Now I am at the end of the row 2 and I will join. You can see that 2 single crochets together with the first single crochet. And then chain 1, 2, 3. Triple crochet. 1, 2, 3. This created row 2. And then row 3. Keep repeat same as the row 2 process. Remember, chain one, and then single crochet, and chain one, two, three, four, five, single crochet, like this. And then remember, at the corner, we add chain seven, and two single crochets together here. So the round three, keep repeating from the round two process. And we will keep this process until to your desired length. For this one, I have finished for 12 rounds. And this one you can check to your chest size. And this one for the armhole. If it's perfect size, and then we can join the armhole. So the next round, the round 13, I will show you how to join. For the round 13, chain 1 already and then grab the corner together single crochet and single crochet yarn over, pull through and then chain 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and single crochet and keep repeating this process until to this side and then join this together same as this process keep continuing now I am at the end of the round 13 and then I will join to this to join I will crochet chain 1, 2 and then crochet, double crochet into the single crochet like this and then chain one crochet, single crochet chain one, two, three, four, five and single crochet So keep repeating this process all the way around until the end and join with the same process until to your desired length. Keep continuing. For this one, I have crochet. Continue down until to my desired length. And I already crocheted the sleeves, this one. Keep continuing to your desired length. And this one, I will show you how to join the sleeves. So this one, the one that we join. One, two, three, four, five. 
create a slip knot. Crochet chain one, single crochet, chain one, two, three, four, five, single crochet, one, two, three, four, five, single crochet. Keep repeating this process all the way around until the end. Now I am at the end. To join, I will crochet chain one, two, double crochet. Chain one and crochet for the next round. So crochet chain one, two, three, four, five, single crochet. Keep repeating this process all the way around until the end and join at the same process. Keep continuing until to your desired length for the sleeves. This is the result that I continue crochet the sleeves for both sides and for the body if we check the size of your chest already you can continue until to your desired length as long as you want and it will be long and could be a dress or if you want to make it short just for a shoot you can stop the length to your desired length so this one you can cut and then weave in or ends. This one I will show you how to weave in or ends. This one cut, yarn over, pull through. And then we insert, pull through to the loop. until the end this one you can also use yarn needle or you can use the crochet hook to weave in don't make it straight because this can load easily so you can make a curve There you go. Congratulations. Now you have finished your own mesh dress. Yay. Any person who enjoys my videos, if you want to support me with snacks or equipment to help me make more videos for my channel, you can do it easily by clicking on the heart shape thank you button under the video and you can choose the price of your generous assistant as your convenience. Anyone who has already helped me in, thank you very much in advance and those who do not press it, it's okay. Just coming to watch my videos, I'm very happy and appreciate you so, so much. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to check out the crochet channel, often for lots of new exciting, easy, and best of all free crochet tutorial patterns you can use to create your own crochet pieces. If you enjoy this tutorial, please thumbs up, click the bell, share and subscribe. Please drop a comment below to let me know what you think and what you want to see next. Be kind to someone today and be well until I see you in the next video.